Bird Worm Seal Script Simplified Chinese, Niao Chong Zhuan Traditional Chinese, Niao Chong Zhuan Pinyin, Niao Chong Zhuan is a type of ancient seal script originating in China. Names The Chinese character Niao, Niao in traditional Chinese, Niao in Pinyin means bird. The Chinese character Chong, Chong in traditional Chinese, Chong in Pinyin means any creature that looks like a worm, including invertebrate worms and reptiles such as snakes and lizards and even the Chinese dragon. The character Zhuan means seal script. Other names for this kind of seal script Niao Chong script simplified Chinese, Niao Chong Shu traditional Chinese, Niao Chong Shu pinyin, Niao Chong Shu. The Chinese character Shu Shu in traditional Chinese, Shu in pinyin here means script. Niao Chong characters simplified Chinese, Niao Chong Wen traditional Chinese, Niao Chong Wen pinyin, Niao Chong Wen. The Chinese character Wen Wen in pinyin here means character. There are two subcategories sub -styles. Bird seal script simplified Chinese, Niao Zhuan traditional Chinese, Niao Zhuan pinyin, Niao Zhuan. Or, simplified Chinese, Niao Shu traditional Chinese, Niao Shu pinyin, Niao Shu. In this style, some parts of characters have a bird-like head and tail added. The bird style sign is a combination of two parts, a complete seal script character and one sometimes two bird shapes. Worm seal script simplified Chinese, Chong Zhuan traditional Chinese, Chong Zhuan pinyin, Chong Zhuan. Or, simplified Chinese, Chong Shu traditional Chinese, Chong Shu pinyin, Chong Shu. In this style, some or all the strokes are winding, thus producing a worm-like character, but there is no additional bird shape. Topic. Introduction and history Seal script evolved from oracle bone script, and diverged into different forms in the spring and autumn period, after the power of the Zhou dynasty waned and China began to divide into different states. This kind of seal script first appeared in the middle era of the spring and autumn period. It then became popular during the late spring and autumn period, and was most popular during the Warring States period. It was often seen in southern kingdoms, such as the Wu Kingdom roughly today's Jiangsu Province, Yu Kingdom roughly today's Zhejiang Province, Chu Kingdom roughly today's Hunan and Hubei Provinces, Kai Kingdom, Shu Kingdom, and the Song Kingdom. Each state in China during the Warring States period had its own variety of script. These kinds of seal script declined after the Qin dynasty, most likely due to the unification of writing scripts by Qin Shi Huang unified into the small seal script, after his unification of China, although they were used during the Han dynasty. Usage The bird seal script is often seen on bronze and iron antiques of the Yu Kingdom roughly today's Zhejiang province. The script was used on bronze and iron weapons, like swords, to indicate ownership or date of completion. The characters engraved on the famous sword of Gujian provide a fine example. A few examples of the bird seal script can be seen in or on containers and jades of that period. The bird seal script was also used occasionally in the Han dynasty seals, mainly the jade seals, as well as a few eaves tiles and bricks. The worm seal script is more common in and probably originated from the Wu Kingdom, now roughly Jiangsu Province, or Chu Kingdom, now roughly Hunan Province and Hubei Province. Examples can be seen on antique bronze weapons, containers, jades, and seals, mainly the bronze seals of Han dynasty, and constructional or decorative parts like tiles, etc. The characters on the famous Spear of Fuchai would be a good example of this category of seal script. See also Bronze inscriptions Seal script Large seal script Small seal script Seal East Asia.